Welcome back to another video from Lord Gizmo. Today we're going to be looking at some impressive underground installations. From laying pipe to installing cable, make sure you stick around to the end. First up, we'll show you a machine that put a key role in the expansion of the internet. It is known as the Railroad Cable Plow System. Back in the early days of the internet, many countries wanted to expand their optical network to every nook and cranny of their territory. However, laying optical fiber over greater distances became extremely expensive and time consuming. Engineers calculated that the most efficient way to continue its expansion was to lay cable along railroad beds. A railroad cable plow was devised to efficiently and easily dig and lay cable at once. One example of this is the cable plow system built by Henkels and McCoy. It can be extended out to a range of 15 feet where several hydraulic levers regulate the blade's activities, enabling the operator to avoid roadbed obstacles. An orange plastic tape is also buried with the cable, which serves as a location marker as well as a warning to prevent accidental damage. Wind turbines are commonly installed around plains and farmland. This is so their underground power cables do not cause any damage to the surrounding area. In this clip, a unique cable laying system is also busy laying power cables for wind farms. It consists of three units with a number of cable reels. The front machine is for providing extra traction to the trencher, whereas the second engine holds and controls the movement of the digging unit. The digging unit is able to dig and lay cables at the same time. In this project, 7 kilometers of high voltage cables were laid to expand the output to 4.7 megawatts. Generally, excavators or trenchers are utilized in the installation of large pipelines. It requires significant money, time, and manpower. However, this plot system has completely redefined the way we lay pipe. It works by utilizing a winch crawler that provides up to 180 tons of tractive force. The basic machine is capable of digging to a depth of 2,500 millimeters and laying a pipe with a diameter of 280 millimeters. It can adapt to hilltops and dips. Additionally, the ripper shoe ensures consistent laying depth all while forming the laying channel. Several pipes, cables, and warning tapes can be laid in a single pass and is suitable for all soil conditions. In short, it's an engineering marvel.
The cables that are laid on the seabed are known as submarine communication cables. To lay them in such deep water, a unique device is needed so that it can operate on land and float on the water. The Nessie V is one such machine. It reels the cables directly in front of the routing cutter and drives them as a team with the routing cutter. Different drums in terms of size and payload can be added to the device. It is also feasible to attach a laying unit plow or milling machine, which would integrate the laying out and installation of the cable. J. Murphy & Sons Limited is renowned for working with exceptional machines and tools. In 2018, they had a job to install a 38km triple 220kV line. They developed a unique system based on a reach stacker, bespoke drum lifting frame, and a cable drum trailer. After digging a trench with a trench design bucket, they placed bespoke rollers in it. Then they just had to set up the cables between the rollers and pull them with winches. After positioning cables, they unmounted the frame of the roller and covered its upper layer with warning tape and mud. These innovations minimized the time wasted and improved their production from 100 meters per day to 600 meters per day. Hey guys, thanks for watching and we really hope that you enjoyed the video. If you have any thoughts about what you just watched or have ideas for future videos, comment them down below. If you enjoyed what you just saw, feel free to like and subscribe, and don't forget to hit the notification bell too. Thanks for watching and we hope to catch you next time.